Here we are on the, the Manhattan side of the Brooklyn bikeway. And you can see it's a little bit better here. The entrance is a little narrow, so, and then it, it gets a little bit more narrow right here, so maybe a car can't fit in this little area right here. But on the other side, the Brooklyn side, it definitely can fit and it could just plow down everybody and then get stuck over here. Well, after it's killed people, it's too late. Why are there not any rocks or dividers or pylons or something? Why is there not a middle divider so a car can't fit? Once the car gets on the bikeway, it can plow down everyone. You're basically in a death trap. You can't get out because they have fence on one side, a, uh, a, a, uh, a, an iron fence on the other side, and you're basically sitting there getting plowed down. Do all these bikers realize that they're in this running the gauntlet? I don't know. You can see what a car can do. You've already seen it in Bay Ridge people Crazy people are driving on sidewalks, killing people on purpose. The, the uh, west side, somebody rented a van and killed people randomly on a bikeway, on, on purpose. This is crazy, 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 crazy. We have to do something. This is a death trap for bikers. Why would we want to create death traps? They created this bikeway the pedestrian path seems to be somewhat protected and also that has more room. This one is exactly the size of a car for most of the way. And so a bike would have nowhere to go. A person would have nowhere to go. Thank you, um, transportation, whatever, for forcing this, but how about safety? Um, our mayors and people, they don't allow bikes you can see the sign it says no bikes on the pedestrian way well let's make the bike way safe peace out